Yeah, hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. The time has come for the thing that I have been dreading. The stone tower and, uh, well, let's just say, not the stone tower before the temple, not the temple itself. The temple's actually pretty well made, but the stone tower before it, oh, here we go. Remember I said that this is the place that Nintendo made just to make you hate the game? Welcome to the Stone Tower. So, while well, you can do a little traversing here, um, you can't really get much further without the Elegy of Emptiness, and that's because of these switches here. See that? Yeah, if I press that switch, it'll kind of get stuck in place, uh, because it's not the right switch to hit at first. So you actually gotta go up to a different switch and hit that one first to move the other blocks into place. Oh, I just went through that boulder! <laughs> Let's see, I think this one will be the correct block. Now, what you've got to do here is you're probably just going to have your ocarina out most of the time. You're going to want to play the Elegy of Emptiness. And you have to do this for basically every switch that you have to hold down. Now, there's numerous occasions where there's like four switches that you need to hold down on our trek up to the top of this place. So let's just leave Ben there, and, uh, yeah, now that the block- Oh yeah, there's a Beemos hanging out around here. Maybe, maybe, might want to take- Oops, maybe you might want to take care of that. How's it going? Oh, shoot. Oh, it didn't fire at me? Really? Okay, I'll, I'll take that. Oh, I took a little damage from my own bomb blast, but whatever. <laughs> Alright, so now we're gonna- What we're gonna want to do here is switch to a- Oops, switch to a, uh- Actually, I should take off the bunny hood. That oh, shoot, I keep hitting the wrong buttons. <laughs> there we go. I should switch the bunny hood off. I was doing stuff off camera, basically, uh, namely grinding for rupees, and I thought the bunny hood would speed things up. And uh, yeah, it doesn't really help over here because you're going to be going like the hook shot, to hook up, oh, to hook shot, the hook shot, and etc. Actually, I'd like some more bombs. Uh, come to think of it. Uh, music is pretty nice, though, I'll give it that, but, uh, oh, oh, geez, frame rate, oh god, yeah. This is one of the times where the frame rate gets in the way of your aiming. <laughs> so now what you want to do, because if you play the Elegy of Emptiness in your human form, it'll just move the statue that you made up from there to go up here, and then we'll lose what we had going down there, because we don't have that button pressed. So what we gotta do is put on this mask, and then play the Elegy of Emptiness uh, again. Oh shoot, that's incorrect. Do, 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 do. I have it written down, I should just look at it rather than trying to memorize it. And, and when I get it memorized, I can stop looking at my paper. It's just that, uh, yeah, yeah, now that we got... A Zora statue over here. It's we got a, a different buddy going on here. He's just as empty as the other ones, but still playing that guitar. And now that we've got, see, there's two blocks over here, but here's where more of the tedium comes in. See, we, now we got to go back down because remember that other block got stuck, and then we got to play the song with a different uh, transformation mask. Basically, because now we gotta go over to that switch. See that? Yeah, and why isn't Link jumping off the ledges? That's kind of weird. And now all three blocks are in place, but they won't be in place unless you put another statue on here. Uh, oh, shoot. Uh, 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 there we go. I was looking at the paper, I just kind of mis thumbed it. <laughs> Alright, Elegy of Emptiness. You know, come to think of it, besides the up, I could play everything with a button. Hmm, that might be worth doing. There's uh, our other blank-faced friend there. <laughs> he doesn't ha really have uh, th that strong-looking legs, but whatever, whatever. I'm gonna take this off, and now we're gonna go back up again. Oh, got blocked by the boulder this time. No, going through the boulder for free this time. <laughs> And upsie doodle. There we go. And oh, I didn't want to climb up there, but whatever. Now, there's another thing here is that you know how you have to keep transforming into different forms? And you know how the Deku and the Zora are weak to fire? Well, there's fire keys roaming around this place. 
And the issue with that is if you're touched by one while in Deku or Zora form, you're just gonna end up being shot back to the very beginning of the area, and this place takes like- Oh! There's one. <laughs> and what happens is that since you have to go back to the beginning of the area, and this place takes like... probably 20-25 minutes to scale, well... well, have fun with that. I think I have to sit on all these buttons this time in order to... Yeah, because one button doesn't do anything on its own. Instead, it's all three of them. I think there's actually a fourth as well, so... Uh, anyway, I'll just put a Goron statue over here. And the game froze! Fantastic! I don't know why it froze, though. You know, it's like it gets more and more frequent as the walkthrough goes on for some reason. Uh, maybe it has to do with the amount of items that I have or something like that? I don't know. Alright. Here's another thing that I'd like to show you here, because I actually I remember that I actually can't use the Deku. It's uh it's too light to lay down switches, so yeah, that's actually a pleasant idea. Because <laughs> that means I won't have to do as much as I thought. And here's another thing that I learned as well. If you were to go on top of I just did it again. If you were to go on top of here, you can completely avoid the Beemos. Because the Beemos doesn't care what you're doing up here, just kind of goes in circles. Just looking for guys on the ground, I guess. Alright, so now that the freeze is out of the way, and I have my notes better in check, <laughs> I can say that these three switches over here are actually unnecessary. They're for going back. Like... If you move the statues, these, these, yeah, those, oh shoot, oh, you get out of here. You definitely have got to get out of here. Oh, poopers, hold on. But yeah, those <laughs> three switches there are just for those three blocks that we already moved. But the thing about those blocks is that, you know, we're already over here. We don't want to go back. We, we want to keep moving forward. I suppose it's... If you miss something, but I don't know what you're gonna miss. There's no treasure chest or anything to get over there or whatnot. Let's see if I can hit the... Uh, yeah, there we go. Look at that. Okay. <laughs> Just trying to get rid of the keys as well, so that is an oops. That is another thing getting my buttons mixed up. That is okay. I'm gonna try and stay away from the boulders for the most part if I can help it. Um, I think that's a switch we need to use though if I recall correctly. So yeah, those other three switches, just completely ignore them. I think we'll need that one too. Um, probably need something up over here. Let's see what this one does. Uh, that one gets lodged. <laughs> okay, so that's not the correct one to hit in the correct order. Um, how about we go and try going up... Oh, maybe it's out of my range. Um, maybe I was supposed to hit the middle one down by that BMO statue first? I don't remember, and I didn't make notes for that. <laughs> I just basically made notes on which ones not to hit, because, you know, to save as much time as possible. Uh, okay, that's definitely the first one, because we got it to move. Okay, I don't I don't care about your beam. <laughs> oh, shoot. Oh, no, no. Da, 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 do. Da, da, da. There we go. <laughs> just rocking out here. Ah. Uh. Yeah, this is tedious enough. You don't have to say that I didn't play it correctly. Just give me, give me a little leg room. <laughs> so yeah, now that we moved our statues, see that's what those other ones were for. Uh, what those other switches were for? Yeah. Um, I'm just gonna hide over here and just kind of let the frame rate do its thing, I guess, and slowing things down because it's even. I can aim so. Um, now I think... Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Uh, actually, no, that's not the correct one. I gotta go down to the bottom one, don't I? Uh, okay, then... Because, yeah, it, it seems like they all get lodged if you don't hit them in the right order. And that's why you have gotta try them first before you, uh... actually do anything with those SOBs. Like, like put any sort of... critter on the switch. Yeah... Yeah, isn't this fun? <laughs> so that means you've got to go in and out of your inventory to get the hook shot. Got to go in and out of your inventory for the masks. 
maybe for your ocarina if you're switching that out for various things. I don't care about that block now. It's, it's on the way back. Um, yeah, this is just like a, a marvel of <laughs> a marvel of design engineering. You got boulders here, so you can't stand everywhere too. So it's you know just kind of burn a little bit more time there. You, you know why not? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so switch number two, we are doing with Legoron. Oh, go, 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 shoot, oh, that's, oh, yeah, that, oh, yeah, whoop. Boulder got me. <laughs> so, yeah, that was not the correct switch. Okay, so I guess go middle, bottom, then top, maybe? Um, well, we'll see. Which, whichever one was the one that didn't have one on. Yeah, there we go. It's good. Yeah, I'm just trying to keep track of a lot of stuff in my mind here, and it's just, yeah, yeah. Let's just, just move on. <laughs> oh come on. Du, 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 du. Oh, I said. Mm. Da, da, da. Mm, 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 mm. What? Okay, there we go. I don't know. <laughs> Didn't it sound like that I played it at least two times there? Well, whatever. Just as long as the game doesn't freeze again before I get to the next owl statue, I'll be a happy camper-ish. I mean, I'm still playing this game, so... Yeah, anyway, I think I remember how to reach that upper one now. You gotta go on the... Oop. We gotta go on the tippy top here. Yes. And then... Gotta... Oh wait, actually, no, no, wait, I'm, I'm stupid, the blocks are right there, I can just go, yeah, I don't have to reach the tippy top one to make this, I just go straight across, and yeah, these sw three switches here too are also, um, just to go back, why well, you'd ever want to do that, I don't know, Oh, why well, you'd ever want to do that, I don't know, but that is a thing, and uh, we're getting, we're getting close to the top, but not close enough for my liking. Um, yeah, let's see here. <laughs> just wanna find a hookshot target here. I'm hearing the the bats come closer though. Hmm. Hmm. And I really wanna take care of those bats too, because I don't wanna get burned and have to restart this from the oh, restart this from the beginning. Okay, boulder going down that path and also down that path too. Okay, keys number Four is it? You're going down. There. Oh yeah, there we go. Okay, oh, number five. Yeah, another thing that I did before coming here is I grinded for arrows. <laughs> because I reset time and everything like that and hard save the game and stuff, so yeah. Just just thought that would be a good idea because of those keys. You don't you don't really want to mess around here. Um Do I have to be closer to the edge to get to Watch it knock me off the edge. Okay, there we go. If it would have knocked me off the edge, I would have been so ticked. Because I would have had to essentially restart the area anyway. Um... Hold on, is this... Area... Oh, isn't that for the scarecrows? Oh, no, wait, no, I don't need the scarecrows for that. I can just jump down from... Hmm... Uh, oh, there it is. So I gotta go, like... Over from here, maybe I should just go from one hookshot target to the next. Cause that seems like where they're leading, from one to the other. Ah, owl statue! Yes! Ah, it didn't take me as long as I thought it would, but... I, I thought it took me a lot longer, but yeah, now I got myself a checkpoint, because uh, now all I have to do is play the Elegy of Emptiness three separate times, or I mean, I should say a couple... Wait, actually, hold, hold, hold on a sec, maybe I'm not done here. I still gotta set up those blocks. Oh, there... Why didn't I see that third... Oh, maybe my character model is in the way, I don't know. Okay, so that one is first. We know that. I got the, got the owl set up here. Although I didn't hard save, so... I mean, I should say uh, soft save and then copy it over to make for a hard save. But let's, let's just do this puzzle here and then we'll call it a part. <laughs> because, it, you, yeah, it just... We're just kind of, yeah, we don't want to do too much more here, you know, we're having too much fun. <laughs> um, oh, that one gets stuck. So that means I've got to do this one next. Yep, there we go. By the way, see that, that the spidery thingy on the wall there? 
keep that in mind for the future. Yes, namely it has to do with the dungeon itself. Okay, okay, Elegy of Emptiness, there you go, I cannot wait to soft save. As a matter of fact, I might just hard save um, between parts, because now I can just warp up here. But I just want to show you how to do this puzzle in this part, uh, before I finish it off. Uh, oops, I want to go down to there, Zora it up, because it's the only thing that's weighted enough. And by the way, this place is a whole, whole lot better to play when you are on the 3DS version, because you have more on-the-fly item switching. But uh, I guess it wasn't as bad as I remember it, I gotta admit that. Alright, but we're done here. I mean, I suppose there is that um, Scarecrow song place to get over to uh, that other spot where there was the uh, yeah the pots and stuff like that over there. I do, I do believe you've got to have the Scarecrow song to get up there. Uh, but oh, where did the oh? I'm glad that did not happen before I got keys. I mean, before I got my owl saved because if I was in Zora form and I got keys by a keys I didn't see. That would have been devastating. Okay, so with that, I'm ending off the part here. I feel exhausted. I'm sweating bullets. So I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next parts. I'll probably hard save. <laughs>